In Chinook jargon, it means welcome. This is your new home. We welcome you to our hallways, classrooms, fields, and most importantly, our family. Yes, it is bigger, faster paced, and even sometimes confusing, but it is a tight-knit community, and we all look out for each other. It is a place where you'll spend the next seven years of your life, and a place where you'll create lifelong friendships. We are Klahalia. Welcome. Do I get to pick my classes? What will my schedule be? Hello, future Eagles. I'm Mrs. Langeth, one of your counselors, and I will be answering the question, what is my schedule going to be like at Klahalia? Well, you will have six classes, English, social studies, math, science, Eagle 101 or PE, one will be first semester, one will be second semester, and then your elective that you chose, including band, unified arts, or orchestra. Partway through the day, you'll have a short academy time where you get to get extra help from your teachers or finish your homework up for the night. And then, of course, there's lunch in the middle of the day. We wouldn't want to forget lunch. Uh, your counselor will design a schedule for you, and you'll get to pick it up on during Flight Path in August. How will I find my classes? Where do I get my schedule? What if I get lost? I'm Mrs. Simmons. I teach sixth grade math and science and AVID class. The first day of school, you're going to go straight into the gym and there'll be people to show you where the gym is, where you'll pick up your schedule. From there, there'll be a map on the back and people can show you where to go for your first period class. If you get lost, ask any adult and we'd be happy to help you. And the web leaders will be around the building also. They'll be able to help you too. Where do I put my stuff since Klahalia doesn't have lockers? I'm Mrs. Davison, and I am a math and science teacher here at Klahalia. You're going to get a set of books that you will keep at home for the classes that you have here at Klahalia. And then we also use digital uh, books on our Chromebooks. And you're only going to keep the necessary supplies in your backpack. So your pencils and pens, your lunch, your Chromebook, and maybe a book from the library. And try not to overload your backpack and let it get too heavy. If you have PE or you do after school sports, you'll also get a small locker there for your belongings, okay? So we look forward to having you here. I'm excited. I hope you are too. What lunch do I have? What are the school lunch options? How do I buy lunch? And can I sit anywhere? Hi Eagles, it's Miss Rubman. I'm one of the assistant principals here at Klahalia and I'm so excited that you're gonna be with us. As a sixth grader, you have first lunch. So we have three lunches, you have the first one. You can bring a lunch or you can buy a lunch. Your parents can add money to your account or you can bring cash and you can pay the bookkeeper, Miss Torgerson. You can sit at any table that you like. They're all fantastic. There is pizza on the menu every day and there's also a salad bar, but every day there's some other options too, like hamburgers or enchiladas, but nachos are usually the best bet. Is there a recess? Hi everyone, I'm Miss Smedley and I'm the Dean of Students. Once you're done eating, there are multiple options. You can go outside where there's a basketball hoop, you can throw a football, kick a soccer ball, and there's a really cool wooded area to play in. Your second option is you can go up to the library, and your third option is you can just hang out with your friends at your table. What if I am late to class? How do I get from one end of the building to the other and still be on time? Hello, future eagles. Welcome to Kahalia. Hey, I'm Mr. Mollick. You have five minutes. It's been tested many times that you will be able to walk from one end of the building to the other in five minutes. So at a normal pace, you can make it. But if you happen to be late because of something that comes up, your teacher will understand. Be honest with them. And the main thing is that you don't make a habit of it and you'll be fine. Have a How do I get good grades? Are classes hard? How much homework will I have? Hello, future sixth grade Eagles. I am Mrs. Osborne and I teach ELA. And I am here to talk to you about a couple of questions you asked. The first two are, are classes hard? And how do you get good grades? Well, simple, do your best. Stay organized and focused and ask a lot of questions. Your teachers are here to help you and we all want you to succeed. We really try to keep homework to a minimum. So we do a lot of work in class. So stay on top of your classwork. I hope that helps. Talk Where is the library and when can I check out books? 
I'm Mr. Backlund, your librarian and media specialist, and the library is directly across the hallway from the sixth grade pod, so you're going to be able to find us pretty darn easily. Uh, we are open before school, after school, during passing times, and at lunch for any time that you want to come, just kind of hang out, chill, talk, play some chess, get on the flight simulators, or most importantly, check out a really good book. So when you get to school, come check us out. What about PE clothes? How long will I have to get dressed? Is there privacy in the locker room? Hey there, incoming sixth graders. My name is Eddie Belote, one of the PE teachers at Clahalla Secondary School. Excited to see you. A couple questions I've been asked to uh, answer, one being about what you wear. Uh, just simple shorts, shirt, and shoes that are really comfortable. We will cover this when you, before you begin a, a, a PE class. Uh, been asked about privacy in the locker rooms. Absolutely. Complete privacy. We do have a boys and a girls separate locker room. And then finally, how long do you have to get dressed? As quickly as you can. Okay, usually we give you about four minutes, but we like you to get dressed as quickly as you can so we can get our uh, get our our stuff going for the day and uh, we don't want to spend our time in the locker room. Uh, looking forward to seeing you in class and at Clahalia. Have a good day. What sports and clubs can I participate in? How do I get involved? Hi, future Eagles. I'm Mrs. Torgerson, the ASB bookkeeper and athletics secretary at Clahalia. As a sixth grader, you will be able to participate in track, wrestling, and cross country. You and your parents will need to fill out paperwork and you can get the forms online or from me at the bookkeeping window. We also have clubs you can join like art club, video and guitar club, junior honor society, ASB, garden club, science club, drama, and history club. I look forward to seeing you in the fall. Are older high school students nice? Will I have classes with them this year? They are nice, but you won't have classes with them this year. The only time you'll see older kids is during um, passing periods, in the halls, before and after school, and at assemblies. What if I am sick and miss school? Where do I go if I'm late for school? Hi, future sixth graders. Welcome to your new Clahalia family. I'm Mrs. Dino, the attendance secretary, and you can find me in the main office. If you are sick, make sure your parents excuse it by calling, emailing, or sending a note to school with you. Don't forget to talk to your teachers about the work you missed. If you are late, the only way into the building is through our security vestibule. Make sure to have a note from your parent if you are to be excused. You will check in with me in the main office and get a pass to class. If you need to leave early, the best way is to bring me a note first thing in the morning and I will give you a pass to leave school early. Otherwise, I will need to hear from your parent at least 30 minutes prior to your leaving. Have your parents check out the attendance page on the Clahalia website, since things are done a little differently from the elementary schools. Looking forward to seeing you. Go Eagles! How do I know what bus I ride? Where will I catch the bus after school? Good morning. Hi, future Eagles. I'm Mr. Winters, and I'm one of the reading teachers at Clahalia. Your parents will need to go online and visit the Central Kitsap School District website. On that site, you will be able to find where your bus stop is and what time your bus will arrive at that stop. Um, in the back of the school, where the bus actually drops you off in the morning is where you'll catch it. It's also the same place that you'll get to go outside during your lunchtime. I'm looking forward to seeing you in the fall. Will I get a Chromebook? What happens if it glitches? Mr. Backlund, your library media specialist here again. And yes, you're gonna be getting Chromebooks very soon. And you're gonna be using those in every single one of your classes and problems are gonna arise. And if that happens, don't be afraid. Just come on down to the library. We'll fix it for you if we can. If we can't, we're gonna to have to send it off, but we'll get you a replacement in the meantime. So we are all things Chromebooks in the library. Who do I go to if I have a problem? Hello, future Eagles. This is Mrs. Langit, the counselor at Clahalla. Well, really, any adult in the building can help you with your problems. However, we have counselors at Clahalla that will help you with anything that you're struggling with. Maybe you're having a hard time in one of your classes. Maybe things at home are kind of rough. Or maybe you're having a, an issue with a friend. You guys aren't getting along so well. We would love to help support you through any of these problems and help you come up with a good solution. Your counselors are, will be located in the Student Service Center, so come and see us on your first day at Clahalla. We are so excited to have you as a Clahalla Eagle. We hope this video answers some common questions and helped alleviate some anxieties with the sixth grade transition. If there's anything we can do to assist you, please don't hesitate to contact us. We look forward to meeting you in the fall.